um, XFi will be used to do the following. Purchase NFTs and participate in auctions on Flare Drop. So if you got the DeLorean NFT from Flare Finance a few months back, Flare Drop is the seventh product that Flare Finance will be um, releasing. So at the moment, they've released three. They'll be releasing the further four products. And of course, Flare Drop being the seventh. Provide coverage pools and purchase coverage on Flare Mutual. So that's the insurance aspect of Flare Finance. I look forward to doing a whole other video on that because I need to get myself up to speed with Flare Mutual, but it's not released yet. So right now, we are talking about a conceptual concept right now. The final two, you'll be able to vote on Flare Governance and enact change across XFi, right? So it's actually gonna be a governance token. It's gonna give you voting power as well for future proposals that come to Flare Finance and XFi. And finally, and this one was where Patty XRP, and he got me very excited by this, which is the governance staking pool. We'll be able to put it into the governance staking pool, which is one of the four products we're still waiting for, for risk-free yield. Now, everyone in crypto, and myself included, um, we probably have a low um, risk aversion, right? We don't mind taking risks. I mean, we're in crypto. <laughs> However, when it comes to Flare Finance and these DeFi protocols, liquidity pools, collateralized lines, they come with even more inherent risk. So what's refreshing to see that Flare Finance is doing is a governance staking pool will provide us a risk-free yield, which, hey, this guy likes, between five to 35% APY, dependent on the protocol revenue versus value state in. So we have to keep that in mind that that five to 35% APY is very dependent on a number of variables. However, knowing we'll be able to stake our XFi for some risk-free yield, sign me up, amongst all the other aspects of what we'll be able to do with this token.